Hey guys. Good evening. Thank you so much for joining today. Thank you for making the time. I know it's Friday, but thank you very much for making the time to join the class. Okay. Welcome, welcome. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Welcome. Thank you for joining. Give me one second. You. You're welcome. Well, guys, today is our last day of class, right? Um, yesterday, we weren't able to, you know, to finish the level because of the inconvenience that we had on Monday, right? Uh, well, some teachers had the same issue, you know, with with the storm and some were not able, you know, to teach their class. But I'm glad, you know, that I'm able to be here with you today. Thank you so much for your understanding and also for your time. OK, so, well, guys, I'm going to begin first, OK, with the attendance. Just bear with me. I'm going to open up here your list. Uh, 9 to 10, 9 to 10, here you are. One second. Okay, so Ada Agar Burgos Magaña. Brenda Isabel Castro Ruiz. Claudia Lisette Velasquez de Salgado. Presente, teacher. Thank you, Claudia. Damari Saraí García Cerón. Presente. Thank you, Damaris. Daniel Alejandro Janes Díaz. Eh, Eliu Fernando Flores Díaz. Present teacher. Thank you. Elsie Cristina Correa Serramírez. Flor Noemí Dimas de Rivas. Eh, Elsie. Vaya, Elsie dijo present. Y también Flor Noemí. Thank you. Francisco Antonio Calderón Rivera. Present teacher. Gracias, Francisco. Francisco Ernesto Jiménez Rivera. Gabriel José Hernández López. Gisela Emperatriz Cañas Ponía. Present. Héctor Iván Pérez Martínez. Present. Thank you. Iván Ibrahim Ramírez Quijano. Present teacher. Gracias, Iván. Eh, Julio César Campos Yara. Carla Alicia Barrera Mena. Carla Elena López Rivas. Kevin Alexander Sánchez Ramos. Present teacher. Thank you, Kevin. Eh, María Dolores García de López. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Rebeca María Rosales Romero. Rebeca, no, Wendy Paola López Martínez. Wendy Xiomara Violeta Salazar Daeta. And Jocelyn Elizabeth González Cartagena. Okay, well, guys, thank you very much. A ver, un mensaje dice, teacher, I'm here, dice Daniel Alejandro. Bye. Alguien teacher, más que? Good evening. I'm good here. Good evening. Thank you, Daniel. Welcome. Present teacher, Paola López. Paola López. Wendy Paola. Ah, Wendy Paola. Okay. Sorry, es que se me se trabó la computadora cuando estaba tratando de darle clic al ah, micrófono. Ah, okay. I'm, uh, yeah, definitely. It happened to me. También me pasa a mí. Thank you. You're welcome. Thanks, guys, for uh, joining. Okay, so yesterday, guys, we were working with clauses with because. And actually, we try to complete all the information, you know, from section number five. And we were discussing a little bit of uh, skills, right? And also vocabulary words related to skills. Todas esas habilidades que podemos tener, right? And we were saying that well, we were talking about uh, a new word, que era a conjunction, right? So we were saying that because it's a word that help us to join or to put two sentences together, right? And we do it through sometimes conjunctions. We were saying because 
It's a conjunction, right? And it's a word that helps us to join two things together and we, we give a reason, right? So I'd make a good journalist because I love writing, right? I'll make um, a good um, nurse because I like taking care of others, right? Uh, I wouldn't want to be a teacher because I'm too impatient, right? Etc. So we use, you know, because to put the two ideas together. But I would like to make, you know, use of this knowledge. Okay. Give me one second. I have here un, un insecto, un chicote. <laughs> and I would like to make use of this. Okay. So there is an exercise. Okay. Because yesterday uh, you were learning. Eh, permítame, see. This is your maravilleta. Good evening, teacher. My first screen was frozen. Ah, okay, okay. No problem, Xiomara. Thank you for joining. Welcome. Ahorita le agrego su asistencia, Xiomara. Hi. Ahorita le agregué la, la asistencia. Thank you. Okay, so it says, write either about a job you would be good at or a job that you could never do and give at least three reasons for your choice, guys. So we're going to put into practice, right? All, I mean, all the little, you know, things that we have learned in unit number five or section number five. Here you have an example. I think I make a good flight attendant because I am a friendly person and I enjoy meeting people. Also, I love to travel, right? And you continue with the rest of the information, okay? So right now, guys, I want you to think. I want you to create your own sentences, ¿verdad? Porque yo puedo venir aquí a explicarles pero me gustaría que lo pusiéramos en práctica, ¿ok? Entonces, what I want you to do is the following. I want you to create, you know, two or three reasons, ¿ok? At least three reasons for your choice. Something that you could do or that you would be good at or something you could never do. Like in the examples in here, ¿ok? Acá, look. Here. I make a, a good journalist because I love writing. I wouldn't want to be a teacher because I'm too impatient, right? Ese sería como el, el, el otro escenario. I could be a teacher because I'm very creative or I could be I could never be a stockbroker because I'm not good at making decisions quickly, ¿verdad? Entonces, right now I'm going to give you five minutes, guys. Five minutes for you to create your own sentences, okay? So please make sure that you are including, you know, the information that uh, it is requesting. Three reasons. Tres razones por las que usted sería bueno en ese trabajo o tres razones por las que usted nunca haría ese trabajo. Okay? So, do you have questions about the instructions? Questions about the instructions? Good, good. Okay? Let's go okay. ahead and... Eh, excellent. So, let's go ahead and create our three reasons. Okay? Y vamos a comenzar todos con I think I met a good and then you said the profession. O... Oh, La otra es, dijimos, I wouldn't want to be a, y luego usted da las razones por las que no sería eso, ¿ok? Entonces, let's go ahead and begin. And I'm going to give you five minutes. I'm going to set the timer. And once the five minutes are over, you are going to share it with your classmates, ¿ok? So your five minutes begin right now.
Okay, guys, the five minutes are up. Okay, thumbs up, and let's go ahead and listen to your eh, to your sentences. Bueno, bueno, veamos acá en el chat. Dice, I think I will be a good doctor because I don't like to see. I don't like to see blood, okay? I think I wouldn't be a, a, a good doctor, okay? Because I don't like to see blood. This is your Maravilleta. I think I make a good photographer because I like taking photos. I could never be an, an, an engineer because mathematics are difficult for me. Yeah, <laughs> para mí también. I think I could be a good salesperson because I like to achieve the goals. Muy bien. Flor Noé me dice, I think I made a good waitress because I am very kind and patient. I think I could be a good employee because I am very responsible. Muy bien. Eliu says, I think I met a good chief. I like to exchange ideas at work or to propose, ¿verdad? Propose ideas at work. Dice Daniel, I think I met a good tourist guide in the mountain and forest because I'm a nature lover and I like to explain nature. So I'll explain nature, animals, plants, trees, and all that includes, includes, but that includes the Includes nature, sin el de, y con ese al final de include. Also, I love the language to communicate with other persons from, from many countries. Very good, Daniel. Okay, thank you, uh, sure. You're welcome. This is Ivan Ibrahim. I think I met a good teacher in my church because I like to teach teach children. Sin la S, ¿verdad? Y children, I wouldn't work like a firefighter. Sin la S ahí, because I don't like danger, extreme situations, right? Very good, Ivan. Thank you so much. Carla Elena says, I yes, wouldn't yes. be, you're welcome. I wouldn't be a flight attendant because I'm afraid of heights. Okay. Very good. Carla Alicia says, my nephew says that I could be a good teacher uh, for children, right? Because I love children and teaching them. Okay, excellent. Hey guys, good job. I like your sentences. Good job. You see, it's it's not the same. No es lo mismo que yo venga y les diga y les hable y les dé los ejemplos, pero cuando ustedes los hacen, you do it wonderfully. Veamos acá hay uno más. Dice Hector Perez. I think I met a good, creo que decía, a good architect, right? Because I'm very creative and I like to invent something. Also, I have a lot of ideas, a lot of ideas. I wouldn't want to be a doctor because I have, I am scared. I am scared of, será vaccines, vacunas, vaccines, vacuum es como aspiradora, pero vaccine and vacuna. I'm afraid of vaccines. And I am very nervous, right? Uh, tiene todo lo que no, no se no podría utilizar como un doctor, okay? Dice Francisco Antonio, I think I met a good teacher because I'm very empathetic and very creative. Also, I enjoy teaching people. Very good, Francisco Antonio. Elio says, I wouldn't be a flight. No, pero I wouldn't be a flight. Creo que es a chef, ¿verdad? I wouldn't be a chef. Because I don't like to cook a lot of food. Uh -huh. I, would say, I wouldn't I wouldn't be a chef because I don't like to cook a lot of food or lots of food. Muy bien. Excellent, guys. Very good. And, and actually, probably one thing that you share, some of you share in common is that you like to share, actually, right? Eh, cuando uno le gusta compartir, eso pues incluye conocimiento, so you feel comfortable with sharing, you know, knowledge with other people, right? So that's the beauty about life, right? That we learn, you know, from mistakes, that we learn from life itself, that we learn from difficult situations, so then we can share with others. And in a way, we become teachers, right? In a way, we become teachers because we share knowledge with others. Good job, guys. I really, really love your examples. Now, let's go ahead and work on some exercises, okay? I'm going to give you here, okay, a link 
please go to this link. Estos son para hacer acá, ¿verdad? En clase. Vamos a darle clic a ese link. Vamos a hacer el ejercicio y luego van a mandar sus scores aquí al chat de Zoom, no al de WhatsApp, ¿ok? Al chat de Zoom. So please click on the first link. We're going to be working with three. So this is the first one, okay? And it's similar to the exercise that you just did, okay? Es parecido al que acaban de hacer. So please go to exercise, the exercise that we have on the link, and it says, complete the sentences in column eight with appropriate information from column B, okay? Then you're going to, we're going to share the answers, okay? So for this activity, you have three minutes because it's very short. Can you please confirm if you were able to access, guys? ¿Pudieron entrar al link? Did not teach. Yes, teacher, yes. Yes, Ivan, me dijo que no. You couldn't. Todavía no, todavía no. Yes, teacher. Bye. Okay, perfect. Y para los que no puedan, yes, ¿saben qué? ¿Saben qué? Voy a agregar aquí, porque a veces hay unos que no les dejan por los tipos de link. Pero... ¿A, dónde, a, teacher, ¿A dónde lo mandó, teacher? Es siempre aquí, por Zoom. Estos no los comparto en WhatsApp. Ajá. Lo puede ver. Si no, me avisa y lo vuelvo a pasar. No hay ningún problema. Eh, teacher, yes, 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 eh, yo, voy a entrar. yo pude entrar, pero no se puede como hacer el match con la... Con el lapicito. Con la oración. Sí, se desaparece. Mm, no, como no, si se puede, se desaparece cuando no une cuando... las dos oraciones. Ajá. Ajá. Ok. Es que tiene que llegar a cabal, trate de cubrirla para que se lo tome. Uh -huh. Ah, ok. Gracias. Uh -huh. Me avisa, me avisa, sí. Teacher, I don't can open it. You cannot. No, I don't Bye. Bye. I es can't. que tengo una, una tablet, tengo, tengo una tablet y la tablet no me deja abrir lo que es. Vaya, vamos a ver. Pero decimos, I can't. I can't open it. Right? I can't open it. Vamos a ver si este funciona. Le voy a dar un uno, uno. Siempre es el mismo, solo que es otro link. Que a veces es por el tipo de, de device. Dele clic al que acabo de mandar ahorita. Y me avisa si lo deja abrir. Ok. I can't teach. You cannot. Hey, Daniel? I can I can open. Ah, okay, teacher, perfect. Yes. I wrong in two answers. Oh, really? Yes. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Vamos a ver las respuestas. Ay, chispas, ni de clic aquí. Ay, se me olvida. Okay, I'll do it too. Yo también lo voy a hacer. My grade is seven to ten. Seven out of ten, okay. Teacher, really? I could open the link, but I can't match because I don't know if my phone is, ah, yeah. the screen is, I don't know, very difficult. 
Yes, Lord, you're totally right. If it's on the phone, it's a little bit more difficult. Mm -hmm. You're you're totally right. So I'm sorry. Yes, but if you want, eh, guys, eh, let's do something. Let's go ahead and try to to do it together. I Hector, mire, ten out of ten. Excellent, Hector. Okay, let's see. Good job. Okay, good job. Teacher, hmm? I just. Uh, do it again, and I have 10 to 10. Okay, excellent. Good job, guys. Now, let's take a look. It says, ahí están compartiendo ya los compañeros. Very good. So, it says, I like to be a physical therapist. I like to be a physical therapist. Letter? Letter C. Can you read it, please? Okay. And I, I'd like to be a physical therapist because I enjoy helping people. Great job. Okay. What about number two? Volunteer for number two. Volunteer for number two. Xiomara Violeta, dele click a terminado para que le aparezca la... Ah, oh, okay. Sorry. Solo del... De... No, no se, envía, no se me envía a mí nada. Solo le da clic a terminado y le da clic a revisar mis respuestas y usted puede ver su score ahí. No, no tengo cuenta, así que no me lo podría mandar. Rebeca, ok. Then, Hector, ayúdeme con number three. So, Rebeca, number two. Ok. Um, I will make a bath librarian. Librarian. Librarian, I think. Mm -hmm. I will make a bath librarian. Because I am very disorganized. 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 Excellent. Very good, right? I would make a bad librarian because I'm a very, I'm very disorganized. Okay. What about number three, Hector? Okay, teacher. Uh, I couldn't be a diplomat mm -hmm. because I'm short and pale. Short-tempered, right? I couldn't be a diplomat because I'm short-tempered. <laughs> yeah, if you want to be a diplomat, oh, you have to be very patient. You have to be very tolerant, right? And to have a lot of patience. <laughs> what about number four? Volunteer for number four? Number four? Someone who can read? Uh, Daniel. Number four, I wouldn't mind working as a veterinarian because I love animals. I love animals, right? You can say veterinarian or just vet, right? I wouldn't mind working as a vet because I love animals. Very good. What about number five, guys? Number five? Go, go, go. Go. Uh-huh. Excellent. Carla, read it, please. I could be a flight attendant because uh -huh. I really enjoy traveling. I really enjoy travel. Fly attendant, right? A fly attendant. Very good. Thank you, Carla. What about number five? Number five, just to complete here the exercise. <clears throat> Thank you, guys. Ahí están compartiendo sus compañeros sus scores. Francisco. Thank you, teacher. Mm -hmm. I could, number five, Mm -hmm. Yep. No. Oh, uh, number, number, number six. Number six. Uh -huh. Right. Six. I could never be a finance financial advisor because I'm not good at managing money. Very good. Exactly. I could never be a financial advisor. Financial advisor because I'm not good at managing money. Right. It's true. Okay. Hey. Excellent, guys. Good job. Okay. Buen trabajo ahí, chicos. 10 out of 10. Now, let's go ahead and move on to the next exercise, okay? The next one is going to be always with a clauses with because, okay? And I'm going to share the link. Please go to the link that you have there. Me avisa, Iván, si puede ingresar, okay? Si no, pues le, le voy a crear uno solo para ese device. Fíjese que, dice, estoy entrando en mi computadora. La, la, la ah. sí, ahí, ahí tengo, ya, ya voy a revisarlo. Vaya, perfecto. Me avisa entonces, ¿ok? Gracias. You're welcome. 
en dado caso alguien no pueda ingresar con ese que les compartí, les comparto uno, uno creado para, para que no tenga mucho ahí, mucho número ni nada. Entonces, you can try either or. Cualquiera de los dos sería el mismo, ¿ok? So, let's go ahead and work on this second link, ¿ok? Clauses with because. Match the sentences in column 8 with appropriate information from column B, ¿ok? These ones are different. Aquí estamos viendo, chicos, eh, las clauses con, como, como la conjunction que es, que es because, que es algo que nos ayuda a unir dos ideas, ¿verdad? Así que, let's go ahead and work on this one, ¿verdad? And then you share your scores through the chat, aquí en Zoom, ¿ok? So I'm going to give you three minutes, and your three minutes begin right now. Bueno, quizás cuatro, picos. Este está más larguito. Four minutes, ¿ok? Let's begin with four minutes and your four minutes begin right now. Oh, Claudia me envió un screenshot, pero no lo puedo ver. Veamos, tengo que descargarlo, Luis. Ah, ok, es el ejercicio anterior. Perfecto, Claudia, thank you so much. Ya vi que tuvo 10 out of 10. Excellent. No, ¿cómo no? La utilicé, si sí era ese, es el primero. Pero ahorita los chicos están trabajando en el segundo. Ajá. Le voy a compartir nuevamente los otros links. ¿Verdad? Este es el segundo que los chicos están haciendo ahorita. This is one. Es el mismo, pero por, si no le funciona a uno, le voy a compartir el otro también. ¿Ok? Sí, está bien, María Dolores. No se preocupe. Eh, si quiere, María Dolores, después me escribe y yo le mando ahí los, los links. O también se los dejo también en el, en el grupo de WhatsApp para que los haga usted después, ¿le parece? Me avisa ahí si necesita los links. Ah, 
Ok, señora Violeta. No problem. You're welcome, María Dolores, ya sabe. Vaya, Iván ya mandó ahí sus respuestas, ok. Ah, pero no mandó el score, solo las respuestas de las primeras, ok. I'm going to be sharing here in the WhatsApp group the links, ok. okay. Me voy a compartir los cortitos para que esos ocupen solo los que no pudieron hacerlos. Ok, here we have the first one and this is the second one, I think. This is one. And this is two. Number two. Number I sent my my word. Ah, okay, boy, boy. Eight to ten. Like ten that. out of ten. Okay, perfect, excellent. Let me see. I want to share the the links here through WhatsApp. So for the rest of the students that were unable to complete them. They can complete them later. Okay, there we go. This is another one. Okay, good. It's a eight out of ten. Excellent. Very good. Okay. Now, what about the rest, guys? Your four, your four minutes are over. Okay. Están completándolos. Necesitan un minuto más. Tell me, are you about to finish? Yes. One minute, teacher. Excellent. Go ahead, okay? Let me know when you finish. <laughs> Excellent, Hector. 10 out of 10. Que lo siento, Gisela. I'm sorry. Vaya, solo tiene que, eso sí, tiene que tratar de unir las dos, que, que quede sobre las dos oraciones, ¿verdad? Que junte el texto de las dos partes para que, se lo, para que lo deje unir. Ajá. Y si está en el teléfono es un poquito más, más complicado, ¿verdad? Porque el teléfono, pues, ahí con el dedito, ¿verdad? Cuesta hacer el matching. Excelente. Ok. Good job. Vamos a abrir este de acá. Excelente, Hector. Yes, excelente, Hector. Good job. Reaction, reaction, dicen ahí. Ok. Thank you, thank you. Daniel está ahí tirando porras, ok. Thank you, Daniel. Ok. Let's see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm going to wait for the rest, ok, porque creo que unos quieren eh, terminarlo, así que let's give them a couple of minutes. Good job. And I will leave the last one. Te voy a dejar el último también ahí en el chat de WhatsApp. ¿Verdad? So you can also complete it. Le vamos a dar un... Lo vamos a recortar. Ok. Shorten it. Copy. Ok. For the ones that have already finished, I'm going to share another one here in the WhatsApp group. Excellent, Rebecca. Good job, okay? Good job. There you have the other link. Okay. Very good. Excellent. Good job, guys. Good job, everyone. Ese estaba un poco más, más este, extenso, ¿verdad? Yeah. Mm -hmm. But it's uh, entertaining. Yes. It's entertaining yes, actually, it, it's funny because it's fun, right? It's it's um something, you know, that uh, allows you to have a break, right? It, come on. Yeah. Not only to create your sentences or to try to say your sentences, but 
to do something different. Sorry, Carla Elena. She says that she couldn't put them together. Okay, no problem. It's okay. Teacher, hmm? what did this go? Eh, es que tiene que darle clic a donde dice terminado. Well, si no, no le aparece. Down, down, down. Sí, you have to click on finished or terminado, and then it asks you, te, le da dos opciones, mandarle la, las respuestas a su teacher, pero yo no tengo cuenta, así que no me lo puede mandar, así que solo dele click a ver mi score, ¿verdad? Que es la primera opción. See and answer. that's it. Ajá, uh -huh, see your my answers. Click on it. And there you have. Oh, what you have is excellent. Very good. <laughs> okay. Ahí está mandando el you. No, it's okay. Good job. Bye, chicos. Let's go ahead and read them. Okay. Take turns. Okay. Number one. Who wants to read number one? Me, teacher. Go ahead, to Maravilleta. She didn't invite her to dinner because she didn't like her. Okay, very good, <laughs> excellent. Qué mean, verdad, ella. Number two, number two. Volunteer for number two. Me, hey, teacher. Go ahead. I don't like playing football because it's very boring. <laughs> because it's very boring, right? Number three. Hey, Rebecca. Oh. Number three. I don't, I don't want you to talk to me again because you lie to me. Okay, está, está fuerte la situación aquí, verdad? I don't want you, I don't want you to talk to me again because you lie to me. Okay, very good. Francisco, number four. Daniel, number five. Hector, number six. Thank you, teacher. Number mm -hmm. four. She usually eats at home because she likes cooking. Very good, excellent. Number five, Daniel. Thank you, teacher. The number five is the girl ran because she was afraid. She was afraid, very good. What about number six, Hector? Thank you, guys. Is number six, people are attracted to their cause because it's, because the fishing and swimming is fantastic. It's fantastic, right? Excellent, number six. Number seven, volunteer for number seven. Ahí están compartiendo los chicos, ¿verdad? Sus scores, excelente. Okay, number seven, volunteer. Me, teacher. Go ahead, Simara. They should take their umbrella because it's raining. Because it's raining, very good. Thank you, Esumara. Number eight, number eight. Teacher. Go ahead, Ivan. First of all, I married Alex. Eh, y la respuesta era because I love him. Because I love him. Very good. Excellent. Number nine, Francisco. Thank you, Ivan. Thank you, teacher. Mm -hmm. During the National War, he was inactive because he was not needed. Mm -hmm. Very good, because he was not needed. Number 10. Number 10. Volunteer for number 10. Solo tres más. Number 10. Daniel. I am sorry for them. Uh, because she cried. They. Because she cried much. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry for them because they cried much, okay? Thank you. Number 11. Number 11. 11 and 12. Francisco, number 11. And, and she began to cry again because he has such a noble soul. Hmm, okay. And she began to cry again because she had a no, uh, such a noble soul. Okay. Thank you so much, Francisco. Number 12. The last one. Rebecca. Okay. Um, don't bother to ask to ask question because you won't get many answers. 
because you won't get many answers, okay? Good job, Rebecca. Thank you um, very much, guys. Now you have an extra link. You can't. Oh, this is Naomi. Que tiene problema, permítame. Ya pude entrar, teacher. Ay, yo contestándole aquí. <laughs> okay, I'm glad you were able to make it, right? I'm glad you were able to join again. <laughs> Very good. Vaya, thank you so much. Very good. So as you can see, right, that's the way we're going to use this type of conjunctions, right? And whenever uh, you are in an interview, remember that you can use them. I would make a good, and then you say the re you tell the reasons why you consider yourself right. Porque es, existe la pregunta. No sé si ustedes les han hecho esa pregunta. A mí sí, verdad. Eh, I'm going to type them here. Se lo voy a se lo voy a digitar. For example, why why should we Hire you. ¿Por qué debemos contratarlo a usted? ¿Por qué usted? Why should we hire you? Ah, because, and then you answer, because I, I am a good fit. But I voy a ser la persona que usted necesita. Why should we hire you? I think I would, I would be a good, right? I think I make a good uh, administrative assistant because I am very organized, right? I like working with people. I like helping others, etc. Entonces, también que otra pregunta sería, uh, why should we hire you? Uh, why do you think, why do you think you are the person we need? ¿Verdad? Son preguntas que le harían una entrevista. We need. ¿Verdad? Why should we hire you? Cuando me preguntan why, yo sé que directly me puedo ir con un because I am the person that you're looking for. Yo soy la persona que usted anda buscando, ¿verdad? Because I'm the person, oops, I'm the person, the person you're looking for. You're looking for, ay, looking for. Y luego usted comienza, I... Aquí como esta, ¿eh? I'd make a good, I'd make a good, y luego dice el, el qué? Because, because, um, ¿verdad? Porque yo soy, y luego da las características, ¿verdad? Same, happen, same happens here, right? Why do you think you are the person we need? Okay, because, luego comienza otra vez, ¿verdad? Because I'd make a good, right? Um, no, entonces, mejor quitemos because porque ya lo vamos a mostrar. I make a good because, right? Y luego dice el por qué, ¿verdad? Entonces, you see, this is important, okay? The, these are important because those are two typical questions, you know, they would ask in an interview, okay? Entonces, you have to be ready to answer. Hay que estar listo para responder, ¿verdad? I'm going to share them with you here, okay? Very good. Now, as I was saying before, yesterday nos quedamos acá en el reading. Por el tiempo no los pude poner a leer porque eso era lo que yo quería. Y, teacher, ¿por qué nos pone a leer? Porque I, I like to listen, okay? Me gusta que escuchen. ¿Verdad? Ya sea el listening o que yo se los lea y que luego lo lean ustedes, ¿verdad? Eh, reading aloud is a good practice. Fíjense que leer en voz alta es una muy buena práctica. I mean, I consider it's a good practice. Es como también cantar leyendo la, la lyric, ¿verdad? I think it's important that you read aloud and that you are able to articulate. Porque ahí es donde hay a veces... Eh, eh, Uh, problema, ¿verdad? Que nos cuesta articular porque son sonidos que no los tenemos pues en nuestro idioma. Entonces nos cuesta articular, ¿verdad? Now, let's go ahead and see, right? I would like to uh, to listen to you reading, okay? Yesterday we, uh, I read it for you. Yo se los leí, 
but that now we're going to listen to you guys, okay? We're going to have different, eh, vamos a dividirlo en parrafitos, okay? Here we have one. Aquí tenemos number two. Creo que muy pequeñito, ¿verdad? Y voy a ir corrigiendo, okay? Aquí vamos a dividirlo en dos, one. Okay, aquí two. Y el último, ¿verdad? Vaya, chicos, volunteers for reading. Volunteers for reading. Xiomara, Francisco y Hector, vaya. Xiomara, ayúdenme con el primero. Se lo voy a ir marcando acá. Give me one moment. <coughs> primero, estrellita, ¿ok? Ok. <laughs> Nearly 50% of all workers have jobs they are unhappy with. Don't let this happen to you. If you want to find the right job, don't rush to look through the ads in the newspaper. Instead, sit down and think about yourself. What kind of person are you? What makes you happy? Excellent. Good job. Okay. Another star for reading, you know. Um, great. Great. You, you did it great. Now, um, and actually, guys, it's true. I mean, yesterday I read it and actually it made me think. Me hizo pensar and it's true. Sometimes, you know, we just eh, take a job. And, and obviously, guys, I mean, yo creo que todos hemos pasado por eso. Hemos tomado un trabajo porque, pues, nos necesitamos, ¿verdad? And, and we have to do it. Pero what if, what if we were given the chance to think about the things that we like to think about our personality that would be wonderful that you that you um you know um were able to find or to do something that you love right a uh, second hector okay please this one according to according to psychology uh -huh. john holland there are six types of personality nobody is just one type but most people are mainly one type for each type. There are certain jobs that may be right and, and other that are probably wrong. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Perdón, Francisco, iba antes que Hector, pero creo que me equivoqué en el orden. Excellent. Okay. According to psychologists, right? According to psychologists, okay? Eh, also, don't forget, ¿verdad? No olvidemos acá las comas, ¿verdad? Los puntos, etc. Francisco, next one. The first three types. The realistic. Thank you, teacher. Mm -hmm. The realistic type is a practical and likes working with machines and tools. Mm -hmm. The investigative type is curious and likes to, to learn, mm -hmm. analyze situations, and solve problems. Mm -hmm. The artistic type is imaginative. Imaginative. And like to ex imaginative. Mm -hmm. Thank you. And like to express himself, herself by creating art. Correct. Okay. Remember this one? Investigative. Investigative, right? So the investigative type, right? Imaginative. Okay. Very good. Eh, Flor Noemi, okay, let's continue with the next one. That's going to be this, this, the, the other three types, the social type. The social type is friendly and likes helping or training other people. Mm -hmm. The enterprising type is outgoing and likes to persuade. I don't know how do you say it. Persuade, persuade. Persuade or lead other people. Mm -hmm. The conventional type is careful and likes to follow routines and keep track of details. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Very good. Thank you so much. Okay. And then the last one, we're going to divide it in two if you want. Okay. We're going to divide it in here. Okay. Como por ahí va quedando. Right. Hasta lawyer. Eh, Ivan, ayúdeme hasta acá, hasta donde dice lawyer, please. Aquí. Hasta aquí. Okay. Mm -hmm. You think about who you are, you can make the right job decision. This is a good example. Lix knew she wanted to do something for children. Mm -hmm. She though mm -hmm. she called, she though she called help children as a school counselor or a lawyer. Ahí, 
Okay, thank you so much. She thought, right? She thought, okay? Uh, counselor, right? Counselor, very good. And the last one, Carla Alicia, please. She took. She took counseling mm -hmm. and law courses mm -hmm. and hated them. After talking to a career counselor, she realized the problem was that she's an artistic type. Liz studied film and she now produces children's TV shows and and loves it, right? Oh. Very good. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. Okay. Now, as you can see, uh, actually, I really like the article and I would like to listen to your opinions, guys. What do you think about the article? Do you agree? Do you disagree? What are your thoughts? Ajá, solo uno, solo uno, no se haga molote, ¿ok? Ajá, Daniel. Thank you, teacher. In my opinion, this is, uh, uh, this is true because for the different type of topic, mm -hmm. this, this, um, uh, this uh, text mm -hmm. explain about what is the fine to Joe for some people? And this is the excellent uh, uh, describe to this part. I description. Think I am a description. And mm -hmm. for this reason, I agree. You agree. I agree. Okay. That's a very good, uh, very good point, right? And sometimes, you know, um, we are not, how can I say it? We are not given, you know, the tools, right, to to learn about the things that we like because todos hemos crecido con aquello de que, ah, es que esto es lo que está de moda y que lo que me puede dar algo de dinero, so I'll study it, pero no es siempre así. Xiomara Violeta. Yes, uh, I think uh, the article uh, guide us to follow uh, what mm -hmm. we know, uh, see what we can do for a job and what job we like for do it but uh, most of the time uh, we don't have the chance or the opportunity mm -hmm. to to work what we like and we have to do uh, whatever mm -hmm. to gain money to survive exactly yes that's what I was saying, right? You're totally right, Simara. Uh, as you were saying before, uh, probably we know and we would like to do something different, but unfortunately we can't. Why? Well, because... Uh, yes, and many professionals mm -hmm. uh, don't work about what uh, they studied. They work whatever. Mm -hmm. Yes, they work, I mean, they get the first job that comes up, right? Like, for example, in the States, in the United States, right? We have a lot of professionals, you yes. know, working in different uh, professions. Obviously, all yes. of them are dignified professions, but they are not doing, right? What they get uh, ready for, what they prepared for, right? Totally agree. Now, this phrase, right? Uh, remember that whenever you say, I agree, Right, you have two different weights. Puede usar ya sea el verbo o puede usar el nombre o sustantivo. Entonces yo digo, I agree, estoy de acuerdo. O I agree with, estoy de acuerdo con. Por ejemplo, cuando yo quiero decir, eh, porque a veces yo le digo, ajá, what's your opinion? Y dicen, the same teacher. Entonces ahí puede aprovechar y decir, I agree with my classmate. En, para no decir the same, ¿verdad? I agree with my classmate. Uh -huh. Luego tenemos acá, I'm in agreement with. Estoy de, eh, de acuerdo con esta persona, ¿verdad? O este pensamiento. Entonces, no combinemos, chicos, el agree, que es el verbo, con el verbo to be, que se puede unir, pero con el nombre sustantivo. Entonces, yo digo, I agree. No digo, I'm agree. No, ¿verdad? Porque los dos son verbos, no pueden ir juntos, a menos que sea otro tense, pero creo que no podríamos usarlo en presente continuo. I agree, ¿verdad? O I'm in agreement with, or I'm in agreement. 
Estoy de acuerdo. Thank okay. you, teacher. You're welcome. Son las dos formas que tenemos para decirlo. Ok, eh, lo voy a poner acá también. So you can remember it. Ok. And, and, and as I, well, coming back to the topic, right? I do agree with Xiomara and with uh, Daniel Alejandro that it's a very good description, you know, of, of probably basic knowledge that we should have about ourselves, right? And the thing is, guys, if one day, if one day you have the opportunity, right, to do what you love, do it. Because there's nothing better than, you know, enjoying what you do you will get sick what you will get sick less right you will get a um, joy in your life right you will feel better and you will be able to um to help others right and 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 actually uh, you know we reflect that you know from uh, from what is within you right so i think it's it's a good uh, idea one day right to consider you know doing something that we love so guys i'm going to stop here because it's time already but i'm going to just mention very quickly the people that were not you know from the very beginning so i can add the attendance brenda isabel castro ruiz ada agar burgos magaña no están las chicas bueno eh, Francisco Ernesto Jiménez Rivera, que no viene. Gabriel José Hernández López. I'm here, teacher. Gracias, Gabriel. Eh, Julio César Campos Yara. No vino hoy, Julio César. Carla Alicia Barrera Mena. Present, teacher. Thank you. Carla Elena López Rivas. Present, teacher. Thank you. Eh, Rebeca María Rosales Romero. Present. Thank you. Y Jocelyn Elizabeth González Cartagena. Present. Gracias, Jocelyn. Vaya, de ahí los demás ya me contestaron. Así que, chicos, I'm going to stop here, okay? But I would like to thank you, okay, for uh, the time. Thank you for joining the class. Uh, you did it wonderfully, right? Así de que solo nada más, pues... Uh, encourage you right to keep on and to um, try to attend classes right I know that it's an effort it's a sacrifice but believe me that it's going to help you remember that this is the time that you have for you to learn Teacher. a little bit more Dígame. I'm sorry uh, for interrupting you uh, I, ha I have a question yeah we will have class uh, next Monday uh, or this is the last one this es la última mm -hmm. Luego okay. tendrían que recibir un correo siempre con la información para el nuevo curso, ¿verdad? Eh, con eh, la persona pues que va a estar a, atendiéndoles. Uh -huh. Ok. The let's, uh, level we will be uh, same intermediate or, or I don't know how, how many levels or intermediate there is. Mm, creo que son tres. Van para el intermedio okay. tres, si no me equivoco. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. That's mm, thank correct. You. You're very welcome, guys. Well, so thank you guys for your time. Okay, have a wonderful weekend. Thank you for joining today. And see you around, okay? Thank you, teacher. Good night. Thank you, teacher. Thank you, teacher. Thank you, teacher. Thank you, thank you guys. You're very welcome. Thank you for your words. Anytime, guys. Take care, okay? Good night and rest. Happy weekend. You too, thank you to uh, all the colleagues. And uh, thank you for the time. I will miss you, teacher. Oh, I'll miss you too, guys. Take care, okay? Y feliz día del padre mañana. Ah, sí, 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 so true. Congratulations, Congratulations guys. Happy Father's Day. Happy Father's Day. Yes, enjoy with the family. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. Good yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> bye bye, guys. Take care. Good night. Thank night. you. Thank you for Have a good night. Yeah. Bye bye. You're welcome. Good night. Good night.